Hey everyone, welcome back. Lead generation is one of the most effective ways to grow your email list. So today we're gonna to be creating a landing page with the form, and when someone fills out that form, they're gonna get a giveaway, and we're gonna do that giveaway through an automation. So let's get started. So there are some steps involved in this. Firstly, obviously you need to have a giveaway. The second step is to create our landing page. And in the landing page setup, we're going to include a tag that when triggered, it will send out our automation, which will contain an email with our download link to people to download that giveaway. So that is the process. So let's get started. So the first thing we do is go over to our little create button or you can go over here to the create campaign on the right hand side, but we'll click this one over here. And then we're gonna click on landing page and we'll do landing page name of freebie giveaway. Make sure you're on the right audience. If you have more than one, click begin. For the lead generation, they do have some templates here, but I'm gonna go down here to the basic one, grow your list. So the first step is to swap out our logo. So we'll click replace, click on our logo, click insert, bring it down, save and close. In our big enticing headline, we will say, Download this, it's awesome. How's that? Save and close. Now for the uh, actual content here, I'm just gonna grab it from my website and swap it out. So click in here and paste. That looks good, save and close. Let's throw in an image, drop that block in there, the image block, click on upload an image. Click on this image here, click insert, bring that all the way down. All right, there's good. Okay, uh, a little bit more content here. So let's bring in a text box and we'll go right above the sign up form. We'll click in here, paste this in. Let's do uh, heading three. Looks good. Save and close. And now we have the email sign up. So I'm gonna include the first name because we will be using it in our automation setup. We'll be doing a merge tag for F name, first name. Okay, and then or we're not gonna add in an interest group. We are gonna change the subscribe button to subscribe now and receive your fab freebie. All right, now we can change out the confirmation message. This is what people see after they fill out the form on your landing page. Uh, we'll take out success. Leave an awesome, your fab, let's do fab freebie is on its way to your inbox. Something like that, save and close. All right, let's uh, preview this. Make sure everything looks good. Okay, do a mobile check. Looks good. So we'll save and close. So our page title is gonna be freebie giveaway. Here's the URL. Now we get into audience and tags. We are gonna add in our tag. You can add up to five tags if you'd like. We'll choose this one right here that I've already set up, but you can create tags if you need them on the fly here. So we'll click on ebook freebie. Make sure you're on the right audience because you'll be unable to switch audiences once your landing page is published. So we'll click save. Okay, everything looks good. We have our tag in there. So we're not gonna click publish right now. Let's create our automation first, and then we'll publish our page. So let's go over to automations. And we'll click on Create up here in the top right. Click on Classic Automations. 
You want to click on the first one here, email subscribers when they're tagged. Changes to freebie automation. Making sure you're on the right audience again. Click begin. All right, so this is a, a tag trigger. So we'll click here to edit the tag that we want. It's the only one we have, ebook freebie. And we're gonna send this immediately. Click on update trigger. And now we get to design our freebie email. So we'll name our email fab freebie giveaway download something like that email subject howdy here's your fab freebie maybe a little uh, emoji Thanks for subscribing. The preview text. From name, email address looks good. Click next. So you do have different choices here for the email, just like you would for a campaign. You have uh, layout themes, save templates, campaigns, and code your own. We'll stick with the layouts. We'll do the follow-up layout. So let's do the same process here. We'll do the logo swap out, replace. Click on that one, insert. Bring that down. That's good. Let's cinch this up a little bit, the header. Good. Let's change out our headline here. As promised, here is your fab freebie. And for the photo, I think just to be fun, we can put in a little Giphy here. So click on that. Click on replace. Go into Giphy. And we will do Amazing Human is the one I like, I think. Yep, there it is right here, my favorite human. Click Insert. All right, bring it down a little bit. That looks good. Save and close. And for the thank you message, I'll just grab another piece from my website. All right, let's swap that out. Click Save and Close. Now, like I mentioned, one of the things that we can do here is we can add in our merge tag. So let's do that. So we can add in another text field or we can add it to the top of this one. Let's do that. Just uh, hit enter a couple times to give us some space. And we'll do howdy and go over to the merge tags and do first name. And there's Grammarly after me again. Save and close. And we'll change out the button here. We wanna say download your fab freebie. And we don't want a web address, we want a file. So here's our file that we're gonna use, it's a PDF. Uh, you can certainly click on upload or do the import from URL or just drag and drop from your desktop. So we'll insert this. There we go. And we'll delete this last part here, but this is a good opportunity for you to put in more information about who you are, what do you do, and why do you do it, that type of thing. Or this is a good opportunity for you to put in some expectation setting, what type of emails they're gonna receive, and that type of thing going forward. But we'll delete that. All right, so it looks like everything's good. Let's do a quick check on preview. So everything looks good here. And we'll exit out of the preview, and we'll save and continue. So one more check here. The schedule is gonna be every day, all day. We have our tag in there. All looks good, so we'll click next. So one last check to review the workflow. So you have the audience, you have the tracking, you have the email, fab freebie giveaway download, and the trigger, the subject line, all of that looks good. So we'll click on start sending, and then we'll go back and now we're gonna publish our landing page. So let's go back to campaigns. So here's our automation it's sending. Here's our freebie giveaway landing page. So let's click on that. And making sure everything looks good here. And we'll publish this now. So the last step we have to do is test it all out. So we'll click on our landing page URL. 
So here's our landing page. Go down to the bottom, fill it out. Here's one here. And put in our first name. We'll do testing. One, two, three, four. And subscribe now and receive your fab freebie. All right, here's our confirmation message that we put in before. Your fab freebie is on its way to your inbox. So after this, all we have to do is make sure it comes to our inbox and that'll take about a minute or so. So here is our automation email. It has arrived in our inbox. Let's click to open it. And this is what it looks like in Gmail anyway. So here's our, our Giphy. You might say Jiffy. Uh, we do have Howdy testing one, two, three, four. So we know the first name is working. And here's all the information I put in there. And then we just click this button and here is our fab freebie. So that's a quick look on creating a lead generation form through the MailChimp landing page with a simple automation on the end. If you have any questions, post them in the comments below. I'll do my best to answer them. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video.